Ryan Giggs believes Manchester United should give Ole Gunnar Solster the manager's job on a permanent basis and have already messed around far too long. Solskjaer has won 10 of his first 12 matches as United's interim manager following the sacking of Jose Mourinho back in December. The Norwegian has also brought a fresh lease of life to a beleaguered squad at Old Trafford and restored the club's tradition of attacking football. Ole Gunnar Solskjaer has won 10 of his first 12 matches as Manchester United's interim boss. Solskjaer's former teammate Ryan Giggs has backed him to get the job permanently. Solskjaer and Giggs celebrate a goal scored by the Norwegian during their time at United. Even though Tottenham Hotspur manager Mauricio Pochettino remains a candidate to succeed Mourinho as the club's full-time manager, Old Trafford legend Giggs believes his former teammate Solskjaer should get it. Asked in an interview with The Guardian whether he thinks Solskjaer should be appointed permanently, Giggs said, I do. We've messed around far too long. When you've got someone who knows the club, who is tactically astute, clearly has the players and fans on board, that gives you lots of momentum. There will be bumps in the road, but most fans imagine what he could do with the money that's been spent the last few years. Ole has done a fantastic job. I've obviously been in touch with him. And he's given players freedom and also done well tactically. The confidence is huge. He's got smiles back on their faces. United have been resurgent in the Premier League and have returned to the top four. Solskjaer has also rejuvenated out-of-form players such as French midfielder Paul Pogba. Giggs added, I wouldn't be in any rush because you don't want to derail the current situation. Planning is more important than the announcement. Look at Pep Guardiola. He got in Manchester City players he wanted the year before he took over. So, if it is Ole, keep it amongst the club and start planning. Our problem the past few years is that we were always playing catch-up. We should identify the two or three players we need if we're going to win the Premier League and the Champions League. Solskjaer's only defeat as United manager came against Paris Saint-Germain in the last 16 of the Champions League last week when they were beaten 2-0 in the first leg at Old Trafford. He has lifted them into the Premier League top four and United...